Hello my curious friends! It's the time of the year when we really have to think about Christmas gifts. I will start with my um, favorite, uh, I mean I like all of them, but I have some favorite bits. <laughs> uh, one of them is uh, Kiel's uh, set. I guess you know Kiel's. Uh, they are a brand of cosmetics that are going to, towards really natural cosmetics. Um, they are a little bit more mid-priced, like uh, in skincare, and this is what I like about them, and I use their product all the time. So let me show you what this set uh, contains. Uh, I had a look also on the Kiehl's website. Uh, at the moment, this set is sold out. But I guess you might find uh, it in store, so it's worth a try. Uh, it costs $29, and here is what it contains. So you have an ultra facial cleanser with 75 ml, uh, creme de corps, 75 ml as well, uh, um, ultimate strength hand salve. Uh, it's a, a terrific hand cream, especially if, uh, now when the it's windy and the weather is so 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 dry uh, this is a lifesaver uh, of course it couldn't be missed the Kios lip balm is the original one without any kind of scent it's, it's kind of a vaseline that is really really good uh, for when you have very dry and chapped lips and especially now with the winter sport this is a, as well a saver <laughs> Uh, also, let's not forget about the Ultra Facial Cream. It's the um, uh, small size, 7 milliliters, but these all are really good also for traveling. So keep that in mind. So again, $29 sold out at the moment on Kiehl's website, but you may find it in stores. It's a good buy. I will continue with some products that I have discovered, I think. Hmm last year but I fell in love with them and I haven't had a chance to try many of them but still still I do love them and what I have right here is a set of their um, of their products their most known products and I think the, these are the first the ones that launched the brand into into the world and I'm talking about rituals products and here I have of course, a really nice Christmassy package from uh, from the shop, and I have here the um, the collection Ritual of Sakura. I think this is how you pronounce it. <laughs> and I have here the um, Magic Touch Body Cream, organic rice milk and cherry blossom. This has 220 milliliters. It's really nice size for uh, for body cream, and also this is amazing uh, it's the sensational foaming shower gel the same the same scent this is amazing you just have to shake it really well before uh, using it in the shower you have to press a little bit in the palm of your hand and once you uh, begin to put it on your body it will transform in a beautiful foam very very rich and also will hydrate your skin it's, it's just delicious and the idea that I really like about these ones is that um, scent lingers a lot on the skin afterwards. If you go on and use the body cream as well, I think it's the perfect match. <laughs> um, let me also fetch the prices. A foaming shower gel is uh, 8.5 euros and the body cream is 17.5. In this range they have a lot of other products as well, but what caught my eye was the same, the same box but with body scrub. So I think that would be a nice thing to buy as well. The next thing I have here are some favorites of mine. Um, and I can say just this, Victoria's Secret. And I'm not talking about lingerie, <laughs> I'm talking about the fragrant mist. Also, you can have the pairing cream, body cream as well. These are really, really scented. You should keep in mind that these uh, creams 
are not extremely hydrating. So the, the, mostly you would buy them for the scent. Uh, I like the Pure Seduction one here. And I also have in Fragrance Mist Amber Romance and Such a Flirt. So these ones, each one of these, uh, is 6.5 euros. Uh, when I bought them, um, I think I took them from an airport and I bought one uh, spray and two creams. But the idea is that you bought three products for 40 euros so, or something like this. So it is pretty, pretty expensive in this way, but uh, we didn't have uh, special delivery to Romania. So I just had, okay, I had to take the chance. So these are really, really nice things for people who like fragranced mist and also body creams. As I told you, keep in mind, this is not very hydrating, but it is, is very, very fragranced. If you know a person who likes to travel uh, very much and still likes to take uh, scented things to remind them maybe of home or maybe they have a fragrance that they really, really like, well, you can go uh, and buy this, let's say, mini, <laughs> a mini of, I think, the, the, the full version. Uh, here I have a thousand wishes, uh, and I have the body cream and the fragrance mist. These are from Bath & Body Works. These are really, really handy when you're traveling. You can put them in your purse if you want to. Uh, but as well you can put them in your hand luggage, for example, when you're going by plane and you can go through through customs and through security checks with these. Oh well, this brings me to the next uh, idea of, uh, of a gift for Christmas. If you know that you have a friend that is into um, fragranced candles, well, I would have two, not three, let's stick to two options. Uh, first of all, you would have my favorite, all-time favorite candles, uh, and these are the Jo Malone. Uh, you will find, I can put a link to my uh, review of Jo Malone candles and fragrances down in the description box and also here somewhere to have a link directly to it. They are just amazing. Okay, they are pricey, but still, you really get a good payoff uh, out of those. If you want to go a little bit down in budget, I guess a very good option would be the Bath & Body Works candles. And um, although we don't have them in Romania, when um, somebody dear to me went to the States, I really, really knew what I wanted from there. That I want some candles. <laughs> Uh, so, I have today five that, candles that I can show you. I will start with the one that I think I like the most. It's the Black Cherry Merola. Uh, I'm talking about the three, three wicks candles. Hmm, this smells a little bit um, citrusy somehow. Um, fragrance notes, dark cherry, black raspberry, sumptuous Merola. Uh, the idea is that these candles, they say that they have high concentration of rich fragrance oils, uh, deliver room-filling fragrance, and they have paid, uh, patented uh, soy blend wax to provide best fragrance experience. So yeah, it, the, um, the, the time that these burn is from, is from 25 to 45 hours, so I guess it's a good thing. Uh, and what I can tell you is that at the moment I have looked on the Bath & Body Works website and they have uh, this promotion so each one of the three wick candles is $15.5 at the moment and they are around 20 most of the time so I guess it's a good idea to go grab some from uh, for, for your friends Another one that I found and it is very, very interesting in scent and also has a really nice marbly lid to it is the smoked birch one. This is exactly how the, the title says, is smoked, it's like woody and spicy at the same time. 
I think this is how I uh, I envision the scent of uh, burning uh, fire in a fireplace. So this is how it, it smells to me. Uh, it has silver birch, sweet incense, Haitian vetiver and smoked cedar. So I guess this one is for those who prefer intense fragrances and also keeping in mind that it is um, it is woody so it's not citrusy it's not florally this is a bit more intense let me show you also the other scents well here i have capri citron as well as the name says it's really really citrusy uh serrato lemon citron and agave nectar it's citrusy and sweet at the same time so I really like this one a lot um, what we have left is Hello Sunshine scent of candle um, Toronto lemon cane sugar lemon zest this is also resembling this one but it's a lot more focused on lemon yeah it's like a limoncello almost like a limoncello scent and the last one is Bourbon Butterscotch. This is a very, very sweet one. If you know that uh, those weather um, candies, it's, it's the scent put in a candle. It's very, very sweet. Caramelized sugar, warm butter, drop of rich bourbon. Yeah, if you like something really, really sweet and, and powerful, this one will be for you. You should also keep in mind that when you buy um, a candle, they also come with tags that you can write to and from, uh, and also with a nice, uh, nice packet, like like a nice bag and a ribbon. So they really give you everything you need. Well, now if you have a friend that is really, really keen on drinking tea, well, I think I have the proper idea. Uh, I'm thinking about some nice uh, nice Chinese tea uh, I have these ones here I don't understand much on on the on the on the tins but these are really really nice also to keep after uh, the, the tea is finished and we have this kind of bags, uh, bags of tea so they are already sorted out just ready for you to pour them this is uh, another one I heard all, a lot of good things about Chinese tea so definitely give it a try but the focal point of this uh, of this gift is this one here we have a tea set let me show it to you this way it's really really nice it's some nice porcelain and they have like little cups I think they're also suitable not only for tea but also for sake so they're really really nice and small uh, also some other kind of pourers here the color is really really nice let's see and also another other type of recipient here yeah and also all kind of things I admit I don't know how to use every single one of them <laughs> but I will I will do my best to find out this is a very refined gift for somebody who really appreciates tea and the art of making and drinking tea I'm not sure how this uh, how much this costs because I it was a gift well last but not least I would like to introduce you the idea of buying maybe pieces of art that are really, really uh, a powerful message to the one who receives it because it really shows um, how much thought you have put into buying a gift that uh, you think that the person who is the receiver will like. So uh, I have received one, a kind of gift like this. I think it would make the world of a difference if you would uh, just give this kind of piece of art to somebody and i'm talking about this painting this is what i received uh one of the
the gifts I received. It was a very wished for gift because I was at the opening of the exhibition where, where this was, uh, was on display and I wanted it so, so badly. <laughs> I thought I wouldn't receive it, but uh, I was fortunate enough uh, to have it. And I, I really appreciate, uh, appreciate it and I liked it from the very beginning. So one, a gift of this kind can be more expensive, but it's an investment as well, so it should be seen like one. Um, what is important to know is what that person who will receive this would like and uh, what is the style, also the colors and the way the he or she decorates uh, her or his home. This could bring a lot of important uh, information for you to take a decision towards what kind of uh, painting to buy. And I'm not talking only about paintings, but also, I don't know, about some, um, I don't know, piece of printed art and also put into a frame or something like this. It's very important to show that you have looked into what a, that person might like, so not to buy something just random because you think it will be valuable after, I don't know, 10 years. Uh, I will put the description and all the contact info uh, regarding the painter of this. Um, it's a very, very talented girl that is just amazing. And she has had her first exhibition this year in Bucharest. Please check her out. All the details are in the description box below. Well, thank you so much, my curious friends. I hope all these ideas have been useful and now you know what to buy for that late Christmas present that you haven't gone uh, in the search of. Uh, what I would like to wish you is a very, very Merry Christmas. Spend all the, the time you have with your dear ones and I hope to see you soon.